Day two at the prestigious Northeast Amateur at Wanamoisid. This 61st edition of the Northeast part of the Elite Amateur Series. A series won last year in its inaugural season by Tennessee's Caleb Surratt. Surratt starting the day three back, but here a birdie on four, his 13th hole of the day. I played well here. I played I played well last year. I just I just feel really comfortable just kind of plotting my way around this golf course and you know I'm fortunate to be starting to roll it a little better, which is what you need to do on this golf course. And you know, thanks to my caddy Richard Kirby, he's kind of he's helped me a lot and you know he gives me a lot of uh, confidence out there. So I'm uh, I'm excited to see what happens. He was seven under, but two holes later on the sixth, his first bogey of the tournament. I felt like I started thinking a lot about not having a bogey yet, kind of towards my like like 32nd hole and the second I started thinking about that I made it my first bogey of the week so um, you know it kind of allowed me to play a little more free the last last couple of holes and after that bogey you drove the green on seven yeah I guess there was a little anger in that one it flew about 330 and went to about uh, 25 feet on that drivable par four so that was a nice little stress reliever the eagle putt on the par 4 7th just misses a tap in bird to get back to 7 under where he would finish after a 3 under 68. There were some tough pins. It got kind of windy kind of there in the middle of the round so that made it all the bit a little harder. So uh, but you know you, I think out here you got to have some tough pins and you know I think the player who comes out on top is going to be the player that just manages his ball the best and you know I think regardless of what happens result wise I'm just excited about the challenge and excited to come up here and learn more about my game. First day leader Bartley Forrester teed off in the afternoon on 10. He birdied the 10th to get to 8 under and just misses birdie putts on 11 and then 12. He would play the back two under before heading to the much harder front side. A bogey on two, his first of the tournament in 29 holes. Then after a bogey on five and a disastrous double on six, he misses the very short par putt on eight. My first nine was pretty solid again and then, um, I don't know, speed, speed on putting wasn't great. That second nine and um, had a couple three putts and a uh, couple just sloppy mistakes that I don't like to think I usually do, but um, you know I was playing tough out there. The pins were in some pretty tough spots, so I just gotta you know keep my head down. I'm still you know within you know distance of the lead, so um, there's still a lot of golf left to play. Another bogey on nine, playing his last eight holes six over to fall to three under, four behind Surratt. Defending two-time champ Dylan Minetti bounce back with a three under 66. I mean, I started off pretty slow and then made three birdies at the end. Uh, definitely boost my way up the leaderboard. And you chipped in on the last hole? Yeah, I had a terrible drive, had a decent second shot, I chipped in. It was like one of my luckiest holes and thankful to end that way because it could have ended a lot differently. Manetti had one under, that's tied for 11th and just two shots out of third place. Luke Clanton's in second at six under, one behind Surratt as he had his second straight three under 66. For a look at all the scores, make sure you visit northeastamateur.com. I'm Don Coyne reporting.